Jeff and Jennifer uh, for coming home, and I ask that you uh, welcome them home with me. This is the last time that I will ever write anything in red. We wanted to send a message to the high school recruits and a message to the high school coaches that Georgia Tech is going to be a power. I've never eaten Waffle House. What am I, what am I missing out on? And when I got here and got this job, I think my first nine breakfasts uh, on the job were at the Waffle House right on campus. It's like a, it's ramped up a lot more, so a lot more energy, a lot, a lot better pace. If you're not jumping around, you know, screaming, yelling, go back, go, go back, turn back around. The national lights will be on us on the Georgia Tech program, um, and I think we should be a national brand. Taylor, I mean. <laughs> I mean, Jeff Collins sounds the way a football coach should sound, right? I mean, he should sound like that. He should act like that. It has been an impressive eight months for him. And tonight, he has the unenviable task of facing the defending national champions, number one Clemson. You know, you want to begin on the right foot with a program, and then you get saddled with that. That's when you say to yourself, maybe I should have taken a job somewhere in Nevada or Wyoming. But it all starts, and it starts about wins and losses. The last time Georgia Tech beat Clemson, Joe Hamilton helped sting the Tigers. And now he's wondering why they have fallen so far behind and how the Jackets can get back up. We're going to get back to that by building a culture of we, com we can't compete with Georgia. We can't compete with Clemson, Auburn, Alabama, in our backyard. Start acting like we are the Institute.